Now I'm going to show you how to submit an application on the Common Application. The first thing you want to do is you want to go to My Colleges, and when you go there you'll be able to see all of the colleges that are available for submission. So let's start with Clarkson University. Uh, that one, as you can see, the questions have been answered and the recommenders have been assigned it. So now we're going to go to Preview Submission Common App. Click that on. And then when you get this screen that says Preview and Submit, you know you're ready to move forward. This is going to generate a PDF version of your application, which will allow you to read the application and really see exactly what the colleges are going to see when they get your application. This can take a little bit of time. Oh, but luckily it came right on. So what you want to do here is I typically recommend that students print this out and read through it very carefully and just make sure that there aren't any typos, there aren't any things that look weird the way that you want it. But essentially it's going to give you your full application and it's usually about seven pages. Once you've read it and approved it, then you're going to go continue and it's going to ask you whether or not you to confirm if you like everything that you see and it's exactly what you want to do. You click that yes, I've reviewed it and I wish to proceed with my submission. You go to continue. Now, in this instance, this particular member, Clarkson, does not charge an application fee, so therefore you can just go straight forward. In the instance that a school did charge you an application fee, it would tell you how much the fee would be, and then when you click continue, it will take you to a place to enter in your credit card or your payment information. If you have a fee waiver, that's another place where you can put that in. So now you go to continue, and you will get to the signature page, so you're going to click on that you understand that once it's been submitted, I cannot alter it in any way, and that's really just for this particular institution. The common application allows you to do two additional changes, so you get three different versions, but you cannot change it once you've submitted it to a specific school. You can't change it for that school. So you're going to click on all of that stuff. You're going to type in your name, and then it gives you the date, and then you just hit submit. Now at any point when you hit back, it will go back to the screen that you were on before. And until you hit this final submit button, you haven't submitted your application. So once you hit submit, click, then you're done and you've submitted it. And you should get a screen that will say thank you for your submission.